Hello everyone, Bill from MadMount.com here. The MadMount allows you to upgrade your DJI Mavic drone with a tablet display like the iPad Mini, the Nvidia Shield, iPad Air, basically anything with a height between 2 and 11 inches in landscape mode. I realize that some people don't know this is even possible right out of the box with this awesome drone, so let me show you how it works. Now here's how you typically set the Mavic up. All right, you open this up, small cord goes here, you go down to this hole, you put it in through this piece here, and then uh, they expect you to slide this and use your phone in here. You clamp the cell phone up and use that display. As you can see, uh, the clamp for me presses my button, so it doesn't really work for me. But for other various reasons like the small screen, the inability to use an effective sunshade, uh, my cell phone gets interruptions like texts, uh, you know, and it's already doing a lot. Um, it's just not ideal. So uh, here's the secret to using a tablet. Oh, and by the way, if you leave this in and try to do this, it won't work. So always take this out. So down here on the side of the controller, there's a traditional USB port that allows a feed to a larger tablet. Uh, using this port and a sync charging cable that came with your tablet, like here's mine, uh, you can plug this in and get full telemetry on your display. So let's do that now. So I'm going to plug that in here. Mavic is already on. Plug this in. And we've got camera. And here you can see full flight telemetry on a nice tablet sized display. It's so much better. So this rig creates basically the same professional display setup that I've been using on my Inspire 1 and uh, millions of people have been using on the Phantom Drone series for years. So now you can jam the tablet in here. If you pull this out hard enough and you can get it into there and you uh, uninstall that, you can jam it. Um, but that's stressing the clamps. Uh, it's not made for that and it shows. Um, you end up having the display below the, below the uh, controller, which is a lot like having your dashboard below your uh, steering wheel. Um, it's unintuitive. So in my professional opinion, the only way that you'll get great shots is a larger display and a proper sunshade helps tremendously for proper exposure. Uh, so this is what you need, a tablet adapter like I've made here, which I call the MadMap. It's a full CNC 6061 billet aluminum aviation grade plate with an aluminum ball head adapter and a heavy duty clamp. So let me show you how easy it is. You place the Mav mount right where the cell phone would go. Clamp it on. Place your tablet into the clamp. And you run your cord in the USB to the tablet's connector. Um, I use a 12 inch cord that I got on Amazon. Now I've also got some uh, slots here that you can run through, so we can do that. Just run it through the bottom there, pull it up. Uh, you know what, I've got the connector on this side, so I'm going to flip it over. I like my cord running up the right side. There we go, plug it back in. As you can see, you can do a hot swap. And we've got camera feedback. So now, bam, you got a full display capable of using a professional hood solution. Uh, if you want, you can use the uh, Hoodman Have One. I, uh, I've used this guy on hundreds of professional uh, flights with the Inspire One. And basically, the whole reason I made this, this system was to be able to use, uh, you know, set up like the Inspire has. Because uh, honestly, that's the professional way you want to go. So you're not using an awkward setup with a cell phone or tablet with a low the controller and you're not fighting to get your hands around it. Um, it's correctly balanced. It'll sit here on a table. Um, it sits nicely in your hand. So yeah, that's how you can get a tablet to work with your, uh, with your Mavic. And remember, if you have this plugged in, it will not work. Um, if you're interested, check out MadMount.com and uh, hopefully this helps you guys with your Mavic. Have a great one.